ladies and gentlemen welcome to the gist show with the boy the d to the e to the double a if you're new to this channel aqua barbara so waiting this up uh, a lot of issues that happen for this for the music industry most especially between artists and what the my labels artists and the my labels you know there's been several issues of Ghanaian artists parting ways with the my labels and immediately then they part away with the my labels whether good or bad still situations that happen some of the musicians and uh, their works could be deleted from them my platforms or they cannot even perform them as songs some of them too uh, a lot they go on in this music business is there something that when our artists are not doing right when going in for these deals so musician ladies and gentlemen musician and comedian ay poyo can post a video you know lately ay poyo has been in nigeria he's made a lot of videos as to the reason why he's going to nigeria to continue or pursue uh, his music career because it feels like when he has a day gana no we know they take him serious you know they earn a dime you know they get shows then things so if a move go nigeria go better in, in music career now ay poyo can post a video just recently complaining saying as he move go nigeria ladies and gentlemen uh either in record label uh get problem i should say he went to nigeria to actually go and work on you know some labels and things just to push his music career which a lot of people are saying that ah na ay po you know i'm the good i'm the man i'm the good at the man you know they call nigeria no? ladies and gentlemen art is art okay so ay po you come talk say oh he did nigeria a lot of people they busy with why say don't know if you find some in songs or in uh, music for some social uh streaming platforms and ay poyo say this is what happened between in then in management or in former management for ghana um, my fans will notice um over one year now all my songs have been deleted from the um on my stores and it's a big deal it's a big deal That brought me here as an upcoming artist. Look at me. So uh, imagine I'm earning um, $2,000 a month, $3,000, and all of a sudden you are not earning anything because they've deleted your song from online because you guys have issue. And so when one is going, one have to cast the, the catalogs you guys have. No, it, it hasn't have to be, to be like that. It shouldn't be like that. It should be like, okay, if we even we have an issue, okay, you are going for you, okay, so we have to share percentage. Even if you are gone, I have a percentage in the songs you are taking because we work together to get a team. You get it? But it wasn't like that. And um, I know, I'm, not, I'm just saying this because I know some people are doing it in Ghana and uh, um, I'm not just saying it. Where I found myself in the industry right now, I have to put it out there, let the people know there are certain things we can um, have a way of doing it down to, you know. This is killing my career. Like, killing my career dead. Like, you won't come back again. You, you, you are buried. You, no, it shouldn't be like that. You have to end. Imagine over one year and how many, how many, how many, you know, earnings like you'll be getting over one year. People will be searching and so they can't find. You tell your son, uh, your friend is saying, ten years, uh, 10 years later that I was, I had the biggest song in Ghana. Kojama Akun asks you, um, um, what's the song title? You say, oh, my management has, has deleted the song. It means you that your management, you are fools. You, you don't even know what you are doing. You don't even know because this is business and if i have business with you and it's a long-term business digital uh, space we have to have um profit in the business till we die then one actually will come and continue but yeah uh, it has affected me i almost died seriously i almost died thank god because it's not all of the artists who, who get the dream to stand for themselves, say, you I'm the man, I have to move forward and go struggle for another thing. Now I'm starting all over again from, from zero. So you should stop doing that.
So in the video, ladies and gentlemen, that we just we just watch, AY Poyo explain himself as to why or what thing happened to his catalog. Why people need to be finding music or streaming music on social media platforms? Ghana, yeah, as I said, this young art will go into a deal or an agreement with somebody where they push money into an act. And the next thing is when they come, make them small, they will want to leave or they want to progress. Ladies and gentlemen, immediately you want to leave where you know live well in a good way. This work will happen to you. And a lot of people they talk say, AY for you. Um, and Kawodi and your papa be now, yeah. What be your problem? I'm the goat, I'm the goat in our deco. But ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna take a study out of him. You know, be in where this thing happened to him. We they hear a lot about Kwesi Arta. We they hear a lot about Miss V. We they hear a lot about some other musicians. A lot did happen. Even Black, when he left his, uh, his uh, former, should I say, label? Yeah, label. A lot really happened. Well, what is the solution to this kind of things? What's going to be the best way to this kind of things? You, they should make sure when they are going in, you know, when you're hungry, you and then anybody brings some juicy deals where it go feel easier, your, uh, your, your this one's more. We they go inside without even thinking about it. Now, this is what AY put you the face. They complain now if they make three thousand dollars or three K from in streaming platforms, now you know, the, you know, go feel make them again. What would be the essence of deleting this thing whilst you could keep it and even strike an agreement on a percentage deal? Ladies and gentlemen, this is what happened around AY Poyo. And no be AY Poyo alone. He's just an example I'm using. And other musicians where they go through this thing too with labels and artists issue. Let me know what you think about it and how best do we solve this or do upcoming artists or artists who are budding up enter into contracts enter into label sign contracts without even knowing the left and right of the contract please subscribe to the channel share your thoughts in the comment section